Hello, welcome back to Cooking with Levi, and I'll be showing you what to make on the three meals of the day. Because we all have lunch, breakfast, and dinner. So I'll be showing you what you can make. First breakfast, we're going to make some avocado toast. Let's grab the avocado. Okay, avocado is grabbed. Let's put it onto our plate. Now let's grab some toast. And we grab some toast. Then you want to go grab a knife. Then once you're done with the knife, you would want to grab some salt and pepper. I had to put my phone down for this one because we have salt and pepper, not just salt or just pepper then you want to then you want to gather your seat and cut the avocado then you would want to then once you grab your toast you would want to grab the avocado and smoor it all over the toast then you want to put it right there put some salt Grab some pepper, then you can put both of those condiments away, and then you can put a, and then you can put your knife in the sink because you're gonna wash it later. Then you grab your tea, or you can just grab a coffee bag, whichever one you like in the morning. Then you put water in the tea bag, and that's a lunch for you. Mm -hmm. and that's breakfast for you. Now let me show you the other one you could do. Now let me show you the other one you can do, but let me eat the toast. Okay, now for this one, we're just going to make some cereal and a watermelon, or maybe, yeah, we're going to be making a cereal, sorry. Okay, cereal, bowl, and spoon. I have the flavorous kind. I don't like all that sugar. And then you have the cereal. Now let me show you the third type of meal you can make for breakfast. Um, oops. Um, um, put that away. Put the spoon in thing. Put that in the bowl. And then this is the third meal. It's a fruit salad. Eight fruit salads are aka my favorite. And then I have this nice power drink that my girlfriend <laughs> bought. That my girlfriend bought. I think it's nice. Well, I made it. I brought it from the shop that I work at. So let's grab the bowl again. This is a different one. Then let's grab the knife after we clean it. Okay, nice and clean. Now chop up the fruit. Okay, and once you chop up the fruit, it's obvious to put it in the bowl. Peach, apple, and grape. But you can't have the grape. I like frozen grapes. My kids don't. I'll give this to my wife instead, though. Because I had a bunch of food already. And this is what you can eat. And this is the third what you can eat on breakfast. Where's she go? Honey. Oh, here you go. Oh, wow. Thank you. No problem. I was just recording a video. Say hi. Hi. Now, we just wait till lunch happens. Um, oh right, it's lunch time now. Let's get back to making lunch. So now, for lunch, we're going to make a nice little meal. This meal will be featuring 
Hmm, what should we make? Let's make sushi. Of course, this is not for the kids because I know the kids don't like rice. So, but let's make sushi. Plain, plans have changed. I just realized how fancy sushi is and I don't have. And yeah. But I will be making some other nice meal. So let me see my ingredients. Okay, salad and a salad with a bit of meat on it. <laughs> a plate. And let's, well, let's cook up the meat because let's cook at the um, utensil. Okay, I grabbed my pan. Let's put it on there so it can sizzle and cook real quick. Lots cooking. Let's oh, and turn on the thing, of course. So it cooks faster. Now let's cut up this. Okay. Let's cut up this lettuce and grab. Oh, I forgot to grab some tomatoes. So I also so I grab and I also cut up the lettuce and grabbed a tomato. Let's cut up the tomato now. Now just cut into pieces. Let's put it right there. Oh, and it looks like the meat is cooking. It's almost burnt. Let me just turn off the stove. It's really hot. Okay. So let's get out onto there. Let me just cool grab my one of my um. Let me grab one of these so I can just cover up the meat. It's hot. And I like playing on this show. It's very nice and calming. I love it. I love watching it when I'm cooking too. Now you cut your chicken into little shreds. Then you put it on top of the meat. And there, now you have a nice salad for lunch. Bon appetit. Now it's the second lunch you can make. It's kind of like a kiddie lunch since we know how kids are. Then here we got. Now we got this. It's kind of like a mini corn dog. So you open it in the inside. Then you cut it up on the inside. I cut it right on open. So then you put it inside, and there, corn dog. Cause I know that kids like a, things a little different, but make sure to cook your hot dog, cause raw meat is disgusting. And season. Now here's our third lunch. It's a sandwich. Now we grab our thing again, a pot, turn on the stove, cook the thing, then where's that silly knife? Okay, now cut the bread again. Oh, and if your kid don't like um, steak, you can use any other type of meat or you can make a vegan one. Now put butter and grab then we're gonna grab all our vegetables that we're gonna be putting inside let me grab this because it's gonna be a lot of items okay you'll need salad um cheese tomato and tofu for this and you for this salad i mean for this sandwich first you want to put the the salad, the tomato, cheese, and that. Then after all that, you want to put your thing on there. Cool it down after putting a bit of meat. 
pull it down, pull it down. Then you want to grab the top of the bun and put it on top. And there, that's how you have a nice sandwich to eat. Again, I'm going to give this to my wife because I already ate two meals. I already ate two meals. It makes sense. Here you go, honey. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. No problem. Now I gotta wait till it hits midnight, cause that's when we're gonna make dinner. Let's change the channel, shall we? Okay, token news. This one is the kid friendly one. As y'all know. <laughs> oh, sorry guys, I fell asleep. This show gets a little bit of boring. A little boring when it, they're talking about the same thing over and over. Let's change the channel to this nice warming channel. Don't worry, this channel won't make me so fall asleep. Now, like I wanted to before, let's make sushi! Anyone like sushi? Comment down below. I don't like the egg sushi because my family don't eat eggs. We're kind of allergic. Well, my wife doesn't eat eggs, but I don't eat eggs around her. I just eat it at the shop because I don't want to disrespect her. But you're going to want to cut up your, your um, cucumber. I also grabbed a bit of more shrimp because I realized I didn't have enough. Cut up your cucumber. Then you want to open your rice packet. Then make this one with that. And then make some sushi. Make sure you also have um that layer thingy. I forgot what the name is. But the brown layer thing. <laughs> okay, I made a lot of sushi. <laughs> I cut up a lot of pieces. Now you're going to do the same with the, um, but first you're going to want to deep boil the thing a little bit. Just a little, until it gets a little brown. Now let's crack off the shells, and we're going to do the same thing we did with the cucumber. Okay, and there, you have a nice sushi dinner. It's really good, by the way. Now we're going to take it, and we're going to, don't mind if there's a few I'm off the plate, because... Yeah. <laughs> Honey, you ate? Oh yeah, I ate. It was good. Okay, here's some sushi since now it's dinner. Do you like sushi? I don't... Oh wow, thank you so much. It smells amazing. I love... Um, what is this called again? Sushi. No, the wrapper. Oh, it's. I think it's called... It's something in the sea, I forgot. <laughs> now I get to eat. Oh, and by the way, the kids are at their grandma's. So don't worry about them right now. Well, they're actually at a sleepover. So don't worry about them. And I'm so sad that we have... And I am so sad that we don't know where rain is. The kids are even sadder. They miss rain like every day. Hopefully he'll find his way back or we'll find him. Let's put that drink back. Okay. We miss you. <sighs> Let's open this up. Oh, well. <laughs> we do have food, just sorry. Now let's make our next meal. This next meal is a kid's meal. Because it really fired our kids. Okay. You'll need a sausage and a potato. Let's cut up the potato. And I also peeled the tomato so I don't have any of that skin. Then I want to cut the sausage. 
then we would want to cut the cut the sausage. Then you cut the sausage into little itty bitty pieces. I can't speak today. Sorry about that. It's been a long day with a bunch of orders, so I just keep on forgetting names of stuff. Now we're going to want to cook the sausage, of course. First, put pan on the thing. I forgot to do that because we all know what happens, but when you don't, then a bit of salt. Okay. And don't worry about my phone, it's really far back, so it's not gonna burn or anything like that. Okay, now we're gonna grab a plate. The plate, all this delicious mess on. turn off the thing so I don't turn on the smoke alarms because who likes smoke alarms? Not me. They're so hard to turn off nowadays. Now we want to combine these two and also put some rice and pea and also put some peas on the side. My kids don't like peas but it's good for their health. It's not like the part because they're actually allergic to peanut and rice a bit. Well, they're not allergic, but they just hate rice. But they're allergic to peanuts. Now let me get, now let me eat this. Now this is our third meal of. Now this is the third meal you can make for dinner. It's also my favorite. Now it's my favorite. Mashed potatoes! Honey, stop yelling! Sorry! Yeah, mashed potatoes. My favorite. <laughs> I used to eat them a bunch when I, when I was a little kid. And yeah, now let's chop up our tomatoes and peel them. And I also add a little bit of sourness in my potatoes. It makes them so good, trust me. Okay, now let's put a bit of oil. Okay, now let's drain out the oil a little bit. Okay, the oil's drained because I don't want too much. I don't want greasy. Turn on the stove. Now let's cut these up. Okay, all cut up now. Okay. Woo. Stir it. Mmm, this smells amazing. Let's put a bit of salt, pepper. Now let's add the celery. And then stir it up. But you would wanna wanna mix a bit of salt in there just for a little pinch. Then squeeze a bit of lemons. Ugh. Okay, that was so hard. I think I stepped on a water bottle. Oh well. Oh wait, I did. Let me grab that water bottle. Water bottle up. Oh. Uh oh. It spilled. It was full of water. Let me go throw it away. Let me go throw it away in the front. We have a trash can, but it's kind of hidden. Because our dog likes to get into messes. Okay. Then you can add a breadstick if you want. Because I know mashed potato don't fill up most people. Then after you're done, put away all your things and clean it for your ladies. Now enjoy! And that was... And that was, and that was, 
That was 12 things you can make with Levi. You can make cereal. You can make a bunch of things. Because I work a bit at a cafe. I used to work at a buffet. And then I wanted to open up my own business. So that's all the things you can do. And let's hope that we can, that we'll one day find um, rain. My wife. My wife is going to go to her business soon so she can print out all the letters so that we can put them everywhere around the city so we can find our true and beloved dog.